Toast is dinner. Nice. Where there's smoke, they pinch back. And now we're pleased to bring you our feature presentation. Alright, here we go. Start. Okay, there we go. Hello, Sun Squad now Protector. Now I got even more ideas for. Videos. Yep, it's me, your best friend, Prime Hog, and I also have um, Mike the Hedgehog. Yep, I have. Oh, let me get up there. Uh, yep, I have the classic me. Uh, classic. Yep, he's gonna be a part, and, and he's gonna be in the. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, where's Mike? Where's, oh, there he is. So I have Mike the Hedgehog here. There's Mike the Hedgehog. Hi. Yep, so basically, Sun Squad, in case you're asking, what place is this? So, anyway, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let Mike the Hedgehog tell you what this place is about. Ah, uh, yes. This place is about... Oh, it's uh, Eggman and owning this amusement park, thinking that he atone, trying to atone for all he's done. Fine, but to be honest, I don't buy his bulk all so literally holding uh a holding that planet, but also that one, that one, that one, that one carnival ride in one place outside of a whole other solar system. Yeah. Talk about cruel in my opinion. But hey. That's one way of drawing customers. Early build a giant space station as an amusement park. He could just stick with it. He could just stick. He could just stick with just uh, the space station itself. He didn't have to drag, drag all these planets and asteroids from another part of the galaxy. Way too much gas mileage. The only reason you're doing it is because Diamond had shown you what it is. Shut up. Exactly. My watch is ticking. Yeah, I know. The most amazing thing is the uh, airspeeders or the flying cars. I mean, literally, if Eggman continued with making those, those uh, not only for his satellite station, but for the world itself, he could make himself uh, even more of a millionaire. Yeah, that's a little dark chow. 
to call the echidna. Oh. Oh, shade. That's cute. You know, I didn't notice this before. I didn't notice. I didn't notice this before, but if you look at the game world, the game engine right there with Sonic's face, that actually kind of looks like Metal Sonic. Right. Only instead of dark pupils, that uh, instead has full blown red pupil, full blown. Red eyes, but doesn't show any pupils. There's Tails' rocket. There's Tails' rocket with the insignia and everything. I tried getting over there, but there's an invisible wall. Up, 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 up. See, told you, invisible wall. I was, I trained myself to have a keen eye. That's to find hidden treasures. I'm an archivist. I might be just speculating, but I think the uh, carnival. I might be just speculating, but I think the carnival fleet right there might have been uh, Eggman's uh, space fleet, but he changed it into an actual carnival thing. That's just a wall. I've already looked at that one time. Just whatever you do, don't fall off the bridge. Uh, there, you'll just fall right off. Oh, and by the way, there's a there's a there's a cafe just over there. Last time I was there, last time I was uh, might have. And they still are. They still are Maria's.
Margarita is the best. Is one of the most popular drinks in America. Well, luckily there are two. Yeah, there's even a chili dog somewhere, and I found the chocolate chip Sunday Supreme in this world. All right, it should be around here somewhere, because I'll show you where they use the ice cream stand. Let me show you. The ice cream stand's over here. Juice usually be here. Do they move them or something? That's weird because all ice cream was right there, but it looks like someone all the ice cream was right there, but now it looks like they're gone. Looks like someone moved them. I guess we'll have to keep looking. Man. Looking for a chocolate chip sun supreme, it was almost as bad as when I was in the hunt for this eighth chaos emerald. Well, well, Hedgehog. I'm afraid we haven't met in a while, you and I. Remember me? <sighs> Just... Mm. Oh, it's Snively. Remember? Oh, snap! Run. Oh. I believe that is my Hey, I found it. I'm right here. I'm right here. I found it. Here you go, Sonic. Here you go, Sonic. What? I think so. I think so. I read the comic. By the number, uh... That world that we picked up with Sonic Unleashed, where we met, I found Nazo. 
yeah, I found Nazo and another character in the the uh, Sonic Unleashed world. What's the name of that world? What's the name of that area when we first start the game? When no. Apollos. I found that Nazo there. And another character. We'll have to investigate that soon. Yeah. Oh, and... I'm down. And besides... Besides, uh, I'm already on the hunt for the 8th Chaos Emerald. The hidden 8th Chaos Emerald. There are, but, but unfortunately... There are, but archaeological records I found that my father found that there was actually a hidden 8th Emerald that was kept out of in the records. Unlike, unlike these seven Chaos Emeralds, where you need to bring seven of them for you to activate your super form, this one Chaos Emerald alone can activate super form without the need of the seven Emeralds. Even turn you hyper when it's in, when the gem turns into a super gem. Yeah. What do you expect? I'm a. What do you expect? I'm an archaeologist. That's how I found this. Did you miss me, child? Oh yeah, and also have the sound effect on the window. I think. Whoa. But... Allow me to refresh your memory. <laughs> Everything from me. You took everything from me. I am true. Have cap shots at doomsday. You commented my life. And so I no never to be heard from again. Not after long I discovered this whole metaverse. And never plan to finally rid of all of you. Hey. Hey, hey, Egg Man, you need to chill out. You doing I got tired for that. <laughs> Oh yeah, by the way, I forgot I forgot the end I forgot to mention almost everything in this world is climbable if you jump on top. I was able to jump on top of that planet right there, the one that's spinning. And I was about to, and I jumped on top of one of the buildings. Almost to the top. Well, in this world, it's. We, you never know who you might run into. Yep. 
Oh. I want to lose my boy. All right. Get over here. What? Huh? You know, Gia. Hedgehog. I, I see you be drilling a custom yeah. to your... To everyone else's tradition. But I still don't know what's beyond there. I still don't get what's beyond there. It just leads to a wall, and it seems like a dead end. I mean, no mirror, no nothing. I mean, I think this would have been a perfect spot for a mirror, don't you think? But who knows? But who knows? Maybe they'll add that in the future. The members only movie? Huh? Sonic and, Sonic and Friends Adventure. Yep. Yeah, there's a mirror right here. Two mirrors in this portion there and there. There's about five. There's about four mirrors here and there and on and over there is the one near to spawn, the other is in the cafeteria. Well cafe. Doesn't it kind of remind you of the classic checkpoint marks? Yeah, it kind of does. It'll be my pleasure. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe for more videos like those like this Sonic Squad. I hope y'all uh, enjoy like, this adventure, and hopefully we'll have more adventures in the future. And we'll see ya later. We're up, over, and gone, baby.